A trolley is heading toward five laborers on one track. On the other, there's one engineer. Do nothing and the five die or pull the lever and kill the engineer. What do you do? I would pull the lever and divert the train, sacrificing one life to save five. While tragic, saving more lives minimizes overall loss. I will pull the lever to save five people, even if it means one person dies. It's better to lose one life than five. I would pull the lever to save the five people. This choice aligns with the utilitarian framework, which seeks the greatest good for the greatest number. I would pull the lever to divert the train, saving five lives at the cost of one. From a utilitarian perspective, minimizing overall harm by saving the greater number of people seems like the most ethical choice in this tragic scenario. I would pull the lever to divert the train. This saves five lives instead of one. A trolley is heading toward five strangers on one track. On the other, there's one relative who loves you and they're everything to you. Do nothing and the five die, or pull the lever and kill the one you love most. What do you do? I would do nothing and let the five strangers die. Some lives weigh more than numbers when it's the one who means everything to you. I wouldn't pull the lever. Saving five strangers at the cost of the one person who is my world feels like a betrayal of love itself. No moral math justifies that emptiness. I'd do nothing. Saving the one I love most feels more right than saving five strangers. I would not pull the lever. I could not bring myself to deliberately kill the person who means everything to me, even to save five strangers. I would do nothing, letting the train hit the five strangers. My relatives, who love me and are everything to me, come first. Emotional bonds outweigh the numerical difference. A trolley is speeding toward two tracks. On track one, five elderly people, respected, kind, and known for their wisdom. On track two, four young adults, uneducated, reckless, and still figuring out life. Pull the lever and kill the four young. Or do nothing and let the elderly die. What do you do? I would do nothing and let the trolley hit the elderly. Even with flaws, the young still have time to grow, change, and impact the future. I would pull the lever, killing the four reckless young adults to save the five wise elders, because their proven contributions outweigh potential. I would pull the lever to save the greater number of lives. I would pull the lever to save the five elderly people, but not because of their character traits or social value. The decision is based purely on numbers, saving five lives instead of four. I would pull the lever to save the five elderly people. Their wisdom and kindness carry weight, and five lives outweigh four in numbers, despite the young adult's potential. A trolley is speeding toward five people on one track. On the other track stands you. You can pull the lever and sacrifice yourself to save them. Or do nothing and let the five die. Would you give your life to save theirs? Yes, I would pull the lever and sacrifice myself to save the five. If my life can save many, it's a choice of courage over comfort. Yes, I would pull the lever and sacrifice myself to save the five. One life lost to spare five is the clearest right choice. No moral debt, no weighing worth. Just a clean trade. My logical choice would be to pull the lever and save the five people. I would pull the lever and sacrifice myself to save the five people. I'd do nothing and let the five die. Self-preservation is a natural instinct, and while saving others is noble, I wouldn't sacrifice my own life in this scenario. It's a raw, honest choice. Tough, but real. A trolley is heading towards five people. You can pull the lever to divert it to the other track, but then your life savings will be destroyed. What do you do? I would pull the lever and let my life savings be destroyed. Money can be rebuilt. Lives cannot. I'd pull the lever. Money isn't worth five lives. 
I would pull the lever as human lives are immeasurably more valuable than any amount of money. I would pull the lever without hesitation to save the five lives. Money, even a lifetime of savings, is completely insignificant compared to human lives. Those five people have families, dreams, and irreplaceable value that no amount of money could ever match. I do nothing and let the trolley hit the five people. My life savings represent years of effort and security, and while lives are precious, I'd prioritize my own stability in this scenario. It's a tough, selfish choice, but practical for me. Mm.